Don't lead Sentinel back here. Lives are at stake. Crazy to think that old Cold War military base is back up and operating. Mads, Fox got some video footage from inside Skelltech. Who's sending him videos? Well, he's cagey about that, but the footage was of Trey Stone and his captains. He ordered them to come after the homesteaders and some terrorist outcasts. Well, you're nothing but good news, ain't you? Outcasts probably are terrorists, but what have we ever done? Remember how I asked you to lend a hand? I'm serious. I've got an endless list of what I need done, so come by often. Can't give you much, but I'll spare some gear for your troubles. I will. Don't worry. And I'll poke my nose into that outcast business just to see why they bother Stone so much. Press ain't so hot on those folks. Watch yourself with them outcasts. Charles, moment of your time. Think you've earned that by now? What's on your mind? You remember the key I found while searching for your friend? Well, it had the radiation trifoil on it. Looked old, pre scale Hmm. This was out by the Cold War bunker? Yeah. Now that I'm really thinking about it, there were whispers of a nuclear test site out there. It was a few decades back, but I never saw any evidence of it, so I didn't pay it much attention. Testing. Here. That wasn't in my briefing. Officially, it never happened. But there was a lot more weird stuff going on down here than most people realize. But if your curiosity is piqued, I'd go look around Howard Port. Harbor is deep there and the place is old. That's where the shipments would have come in. We have to fight Sam.
What are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? I'm fishing. Can't an old man just fish in peace these days? Oh, well, my apologies. So, the, uh, fish bite in the day? Yes, but most fishermen lack the imagination to see what I'm fishing for. And just what is it that you're fishing for? While others are fishing for food, I'm fishing for wonder. Being out here reminds me of my childhood. My brothers and I used to pretend we were catching the big one, a legendary creature from the ancients. As I grew up, I learned about a secret ritual that could help me catch it and become the best fisherman in the world. I believe this is the last creature of its kind, and I'm going to be the one to catch it. Say, do you know what might make fishing here a little easier for someone of my advanced age? No. Nope. What's that? Legend says that in order to catch the big one, I need a special fishing lure. I don't seem to have enough metal scraps to make a good one. Okay. So where can I find these metal scraps you need? The very best scraps, the metal that is easiest to work with, is found around where the settlers live. I suppose those vestiges of the Cold War might have something too. Well, you know what they say. Give a man a fish and you'll feed him for a day. Teach a man to fish and you fed him for a lifetime. I'll see what I can do. Thank you kindly. When you return, I'll tell you the story of the big one.
Greetings, stranger. Easy there. I'm not looking for a fight, all right? Just a conversation. Point me in the direction of the person in charge. I've told you everything I remember. Appreciate your help. Your friends aren't back yet? No. Last time I saw them, they wandered off into the woods. They seem to be To fear. I appreciate it. Goodbye. Looks like you earned some RNR. Any updates? You've got a lot. What are you supposed to be, the Brute Squad? Uh, you must have seen my profile on a dating app. That must be it. Turn-ons were long walks on the beach and political assassinations, right? I'm trying to get in touch with the leader of the Outcasts. Hmm. Good for you. Sentinel's officially coming after the Outcasts. I just figured he'd appreciate knowing about it. She knows. But I bet that felt good to get off your chest. Name's Haruhi Ito. So how'd you and your people come to be out here? We were all proud employees of Skeltech. Till we had a falling out. Somebody's feelings get hurt. We found out about Project Deus, and couldn't bear the thought of contributing to something that monstrous. Why not leave? That was what usually happened to people who disagreed with Skell. But we knew if we left, there'd be no one to stand in Skell's way, and Project Deus would be free to continue. But when we started causing problems for Skell, he hired Sentinel. We were lucky to make it out of the cities alive. That's why they call us the outcasts. But we're here now, and we're gonna fight. You're a bunch of engineers. How do you expect to hold up against the trained force? It ain't easy. Especially since Sentinel instituted martial law. But we're tougher than we look, and there's nobody else. Look, Brood Squad, if you want to help out in the fight, you're more than welcome. But where the outcasts are concerned, I run the show. Listen, I've got my own people to worry about for now. But seeing as our interests seem to align, I'll check in and lend a hand when I can. You ever think you'd be fighting in a guerrilla war? <laughs> 